that. Any time that you get a lump in a glandular tissue, Bob, whether it's the breast or the prostate or the thyroid, the first question that comes to mind is, could it be cancer? And that does worry everybody. Anytime you got a lump, you say, uh-oh. Well, fortunately for both me and the patient, when it comes to the thyroid, the answer to that question is, eh, usually not. Statistically, no more than about one out of 20 lumps in the thyroid is cancerous. All the rest are completely benign. And even the cancerous ones are very low-grade cancers. If you rank cancers on a scale of 1 to 10 in terms of their propensity to cause disability or death, breast cancer is about a 6 or a 7, colon cancer is a 9, lung cancer is an 11, thyroid is about a 0.1. It's wow. about as benign as you can get and still call it so cancer. So if you're going to get a cancer, it'd be good to have a basal cell on the skin or a thyroid Pray that cancer. it be thyroid. Now, yep. uh, tell me about, does the cancer of the thyroid, the little nodule, does it feel different? Or a nodule is a nodule is a nodule? No, the vast majority of cancerous nodules feel a lot more firm. And to an experienced examiner, you can often get a real good suspicion that one is not a good actor just by the texture. It just feels different. A normal thyroid, as I said, is very soft and squishy. Nodules tend to be much more firm and, and clear margins. And of course, the more firm they are, the more suspicious you get.